Mm. Let's study about the hoof. So the hoof is made up of mainly uh, two parts. That is the uh, outer portion which is developed from the epidermis called as the hoof and the inner portion uh, developed from the dermis called as the corium. So this is the corium, this is the hoof. Now the hoof has, uh, first part of the hoof is the wall. So the entire thing is wall. It is made up of the front portion it is called as the toe, the side it is called as the quarter and the heel. Toe, quarter, heel. Okay. <coughs> On the ventral surface we will get the sole. So this, is the, this, this part is a sole and the wall uh, is differentiated from the sole or separated from the sole from the, is, uh, that is called as the white line. So this is the white line which separates the wall from the sole. Okay. And uh, the wall has project, uh, projection over the sole that is called as a bar. So these two are the bar. These are the projections of the wall over the sole. Okay. Uh, the heart of the hoof called as the frog which is a triangular portion. Uh, the, there is a depression in uh, or a ju junction between the sole and the frog that is called as the collateral sulcus. So these two are the collateral sulcus. This center one is the central sulcus. Medial sulcus. So it is called as the medial sulcus. These are the collateral sulcus. Now the corium goes inside the hoof. Okay, now we will study about the corium. Insensitive <coughs> lamina. This is insensitive part. So we will study about the corium. So corium is uh, made up of on the anterior surface. Now the corium, uh, on the front portion of the corium we will find the sensitive lamina. So all these projections are the sensitive lamina. Up, um, above that it is called as the coronary band. So the and above the coronary band we will find the perioplic band or the periopal. The function of the coronary band is that it, is, it will keep producing hoof. So the hoof is produced from the coronary band and the periopal produces a waxy substance uh, which is above the uh, wall that which will help in or prevent cracking of the hoof. The junction between the skin and the coronary band or as the coronary uh, The coronary corium has sensitive lamina. All these are sensitive lamina and this will uh, attach to the hoof. I mean, this has, these, these sensitive lamina will have corresponding uh, uh, grooves in that, uh, which is of the, this is called as insensitive lamina. So, the insensitive lamina of the hoof will attach to the sensitive lamina of the corium. And the uh, hoof, is, the corium is attached to the hoof uh, by two 